Hey Pacific Crest, this is uh, our weekly kind of update. Uh, we'll continue to do these for the foreseeable future. A um, couple things, we're doing really, really good with masks and cleaning, so just pat yourself on the back. We really appreciate it. Um, you guys are doing great. Um, things we're gonna do to try to make your environment safer and easier to use. Um, we ordered another 40 feet of rig so you can just imagine that where the rowers and bikes are now that whole side of the gym will have rig in the next three weeks or so um, and that way you, everyone will have their own pull-up bar wall ball target and squat rack so you won't have to move from square to rack and we won't have to divide up the workouts and all that you're going to have your own spot um, like anything it'll take some learning and streamlining but we'll get there so that's happening um, we're having some monitor problems on the rower so we're gonna ask you to not spray bleach uh, or any liquid onto those anymore the, the coach that's coaching your class will handle that so you just you can clean up your handles and your seats and then your coach is going to come behind you with a wipe and wipe down the monitor so that'd be helpful and we're gonna keep our 7 a.m. zoom class in a modified form going forward so we start our 7 15 a.m. CrossFit class Monday but we do have some people that are kind of depending on that 7 a.m. so the coach that's coaching the 7 15 is going to open zoom and get at 7 and get this zoom folks started and then just keep the computer going while they coach the 7 15 so it'll be kind of like open gym ish on zoom um, and let's see training wise for your strength training we're gonna be it's kind of a mishmash for the next few weeks until we get this rig sorted out once we get the rig sorted out we'll get back into a formal lifting progression um, so we're gonna try to get some squatting in some pressing in we'll do more Olympic weightlifting power cleans cleans and so forth snatches um, so that'll be good for us I know we're all a bit rusty um, but that's kind of what we're gonna be doing for the next few weeks until we get that rig all set up okay big drama CrossFit drama news we are re-affiliated with CrossFit so um, we de-affiliated because of coach Glassman's comments around um, George Floyd which were inappropriate and about 1500 affiliates did the same thing um, Initially, the change CrossFit was going to make was to have Greg Glassman step down as CEO but retain 100% ownership. I didn't find that acceptable change, um, and nor I don't think many other people did either. So last week, uh, they started the sale of the company. So Greg Glassman sold CrossFit to a man named Eric Rosa who has owned a CrossFit affiliate in Boulder for 10 years um, and he will be the new CEO of CrossFit and that was a pretty positive step the, the next thing that came down the pipe was a woman who, named Nicole Carroll who has been part of CrossFit for at least 15 years and who r runs their training division she stepped down as well uh, actually before the George Floyd comment there was some other stuff going on in CrossFit that prompted her stepping down but she announced she would be coming back to CrossFit and that was really the the big impetus for me to come back she's very well respected um, she's uh, very level-headed very professional and um, that was a really nice step so what do we do with our logo? I don't know, really. I mean, I kind of like community fitness. So we're a CrossFit gym, but we might just be Pacific Crest Community Fitness. Um, we got community fitness shirts on the way. So um, for all of you that have been with us through COVID, those are on us. So when we get them in, we're just going to ask you your size and we're going to we're going to have those out for you. Um, but uh, maybe the next one will be a CrossFit shirt. Who knows? We'll see. So anyways, as always, um, thank you so much for all your patience with us and we'll see you in the gym.